Good job, Spider-Man. Um, who are you exactly? I'm Police Captain George Stacy. Oh, you're, uh, um, never mind. What were you going to say? Wasn't gonna say anything. Spider-Man, there's a shootout in Harlem. Mind giving us a hand? A shootout? Well, looks like that guy needs to be taught a lesson. Right to there. <laughs> hey, stop shooting people, it's mean! Spider-Man! You... you killed my uncle! Oh, I killed Spider-Man's uncle! I wish I remembered him, but I have too much blood on my hands! I can't remember which is his! I'm gonna kill you, you piece of trash! <laughs> Spider-Man, stop! This monster killed one of my only relatives! This guy has killed plenty of relatives. He's a serial killer. Just stop attacking him. We have to put him in custody. Fine. But make sure he never escapes. You're doing the right thing. <sighs> Why can't I just skip the day? Whoa! Hey! One. You kind of scared me. Oh, sorry. Shouldn't we be getting to class? I'd much rather be spending time with my boyfriend, than with boring school lessons. But it's the very first day of 12th grade. Do you really want to be late on the first day for the last grade of school for no good reason? I don't really care. Can we at least spend the majority of the first subject here, and then get to the classes? I guess. So, anything interesting happened to you over the summer? Well, I just met your dad yesterday. How? Doing Spider-Man work. Well, I'm glad you met him without him embarrassing me. What did you do together? I actually finally put my uncle's killer behind bars. Wait, really? He's finally been locked up? Yeah, he surprisingly hasn't been locked up in prison for a pretty long time. Well, that's good. He won't hurt any more innocent people. I should feel happy that he's not on the streets anymore, but I'm not. Instead, I just feel sad after seeing him again. It reminds me that my uncle is gone, and he won't come back. <sighs> I get that. Every time I'm reminded of my mom's death, I always end up feeling stressed and sad. Right now, I'm just... I'm not feeling like staying for a full six hours of school. I just feel like staying home. Well, why don't you stay home? Because I don't want to fail or repeat my last year of school. After this year, I don't want to go to school ever again, believe it or not. I'm so glad that this is the last year of school. I've put up with it for far too long. Yeah... Everyone feels that way. Wow, you losers can't even make it to the first subject of the first day of 12th grade. You're getting worse grades than I am. What do we have next, Flash? Jim, you're gonna get destroyed. 
Are you sure you don't want to skip another subject? No, we already skipped one subject. If we skip another, we'll probably get detention. To be honest, I'd much rather get in big trouble than constantly getting my butt kicked in gym. Real tumble you took back there, eh, puny Parker? That's it, I've put up with him for too long. Hey, Flash! <laughs> Find <laughs> back! <laughs> you shouldn't do anything physical, because you're the worst at a loser. Peter, are you sure you'll be able to do the rest of the day? I'm sorry, I just- I've been getting so stressed after meeting my uncle's killer again. Look, it's gonna be okay. If you're not feeling good, then take the rest of the day off. No, I think I'll be able to be okay for now. So, my place next? No, actually, first I'm gonna drop by my aunt's place, tell her the news, and then I'll come by your place. Can't wait. Peter! Um, hi. Is something wrong? Uh, well, you know that guy who killed Uncle Ben? He's just been locked up. Oh, I'm surprised! I think I may pay him a visit. Do you want to come? Uh, no. I actually have to go by Gwen's next. Okay, I get it. Yes? Um, hi, Mr. Stacy. I'm Peter. Are you my daughter's boyfriend? Yeah. Come in. Peter, you're here! Hey, Gwen. So we just hang out and talk in your bedroom as usual? Sure, I guess. Do you two need anything? No, I think we'll be fine. Okay, good. One for Rikers Island, please! Well, did he embarrass you? Not really. What did your aunt say to the news? She said she'll pay him a visit. Hello, wrinkles! Yo! Oh. You killed my husband! I killed a lot of husbands! You all gotta be more specific! Ben Parker. He was a lovely man. Still not ringing a bell? He was the greatest man I ever knew. You took him from me. And from my nephew! Well, if I can't remember his name even, then maybe it's a good thing he died! Oh, you monster! You mistake of a person! You'll die! Miss Parker, stop! <laughs> Take Miss Parker to the shore. Thank you for stopping me from doing something unethical, Gilbert! Sorry about that, Cletus. Take me to your research projects. Then give me the most dangerous and powerful one or I'll kill you! Alright. Well, any of your enemies break out recently? Nope. Nothing really exciting has happened since Mysterio. Have you found him yet? Nope. He's been invisible for the full summer. What about Venom? Has anything come of him? I've been searching for him this whole time. Still nothing. Still hiding? Well, right now I'm just glad that nothing bad is happening. This symbiote is like the one that made Venom into Venom, except it's red and more powerful. This symbiote? It made Venom into Venom and is more powerful. Yes, that's what I just said. I will have all that power. Imagine all the deaths, all the mayhem. It'll be glorious. <laughs> Gwen, I gotta go. Quidus Cassidy has escaped from custody, and he's got an alien parasite on him. Go! Die! All of you must die! Yes! With this symbiote, I can cause major mayhem, peril, chaos, carnage. Yes, I'm carnage! Looks like Carnage is gonna die the same day you were born. Venom, what you doing here? Showing you who's the superior symbiote. Time to put the suit's full capabilities to the test! Ah! Ah! What? They 
said my symbiote, symbiote was more powerful than your symbiote. I did it! Wait! Look who's all the way over there! Uh, nothing. Come on, Peter. Dad, be okay. You'll pay for killing my uncle, Carnage. I will kill you, Spider-Man! <laughs> Captain Stacy, wouldn't it be great? If I made an orphan of his child? No! Let's see, a symbiote's two weaknesses are fire and sound. Hmm. That was painful, but, but this symbiote is less, less vulnerable to sound. And maybe it's more vulnerable to fire. It looks like you have to cause a huge explosion. Where my Michael Bay? Everyone here evacuate! This area is about to explode. This place looks so, so deserted, deserted for New York. Hopefully everyone here died. Yeah, and that's good. There's no one here you can kill. It's time to end this. This will never be over, Spider-Man. Spider-Man, are you okay? Yeah, I did it. Now everyone's happy. Spider-Man! You caused so much damage, I bet you and this carnage are working together. Get out of my city, you menace! Almost everyone. Give me back the symbiote! All of you will be murdered by carnage! Is the symbiote destroyed? No, it's still very much alive. But have we damaged after the explosion? Destroy it. Immediately. We can't. It could be used to help enhance the abilities of the army. Or other cops if we need to fight a worldwide threat. But I don't want that thing getting back on Cassidy. Especially because he's the one that killed my uncle. Don't worry. Quidus is going to be locked up forever. Alright, Tombs. Your bail has been paid. 